What's up guys, Skitter Rampage here. So today we're going to be opening up a Funko Pop pre-order that I've been waiting for for about a year now. And we could possibly get a chase. So let's see if we get one. Welcome back to another Funko Pop video. Today we do have a little bit of an unboxing and we do have a little bit of a chase roulette here. So, um, this is one package that I did not know I even ordered, to be honest. I don't remember ordering this like almost eight, nine months ago or whatever. Something crazy. It's been almost a year now. It's absolutely nuts. But, um, yeah guys, I did actually order one from Galactic Toys. And it's the Tanjiro, um, the Hinokami Kagura Dance here. And... I don't know if I got a chase or not. I ordered a single apparently, and then it just kind of like gave me a shipping notification. I was like, oh, okay, so maybe we got a chance. I think we have like a one in six chance. I didn't want to order the bundle because I had already spent so much for Funko Ween with all the other ones, so um, I just kind of took a chance, I guess, at the time. I don't even remember taking the chance. Now we do have a couple other things to go over and unbox in this video. One being that we do actually have a custom bloody Tanjiro here as a giveaway. So if you guys want to see this given away here in the next week or two weeks, make sure to leave a like on the video. It lets me know how fast I can get this giveaway out for you guys. Either way, check that out, guys. That's really, really awesome from Notorious Customs. So we'll talk about that a little bit later and we'll even open this and uh, show you guys it on the channel here. Now, Captain Pops actually came across these in Target and he said, hey, I got one for you. So I finally have the Hobgoblin Tea Bundle, which is super awesome. And then we even have one more package from Target here. It's a bigger box. I actually opened it already because I was really scared because I heard it just kind of clanking around in there. So I was like, oh no. And there's also a hole in the box. So, and actually funny enough, that Target tape that you guys see on the bottom here, it was actually half hanging off. I don't know why, but it was half hanging off. <laughs> so, uh, we do have a couple things to kind of like unbox in this video. I guess since this box is open, let's just jump into it. Uh, so this is actually the Stardust Dragon here from Yu-Gi-Oh. I picked up the um, the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon, so I figured why not? Uh, well, I guess I pre-ordered this one first technically, but this thing is sick. It's actually a lot bigger in person than I thought it was. So yeah, guys, like I said, it was just kind of clanking around in there, but there was some padding, a little bit of padding. so. I mean, at least it didn't get damaged, I don't think so, at least. It looks pretty good. Oh, well. Uh, so I think I waited about, ooh, the in, innards damage. Anyways, we, we waited roughly about three, four months for this one, I think. Um, again, another thing I forgot I pre-ordered and I just got a shipping notification. I was like, okay, cool. All right. Oh, dang, they really shoved this one in there. The insert's all messed up. Oh my gosh. Can I get this out? Yeah, you see that? Oh, that thing's ruined. That sucks. You know, I actually originally thought I ordered two of these, but apparently I didn't. Um, I do have the Winged Dragon of Raw coming as well. Actually, it delivered. I just, all my last pre-orders have all delivered to my mom's house, where I previously lived. And now they live here, so all my pre-orders are going there, and it's so far to drive. So it's really annoying. <laughs> but anyways, guys, guys, this looks amazing. So I don't know much about the character, to be honest, but he just looked too cool. So I put in my pre-order a while back. And, uh, I definitely wanted to unbox this one. I unboxed Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon, and uh, I think if I get the rest of the um, the uh, gods and everything from Yu-Gi-Oh, we can definitely do like a full unboxing of all of them, and I can definitely look them up and learn a little bit more about them. Either way, this is freaking insane. Look at those wings. It's not metallic, funny enough, but it does look metallic. It would have been really cool if they did actually give it a more of a metallic look. The paint job's rough on this, though, I will say. It is rough all over. The silver paint that they did use looks rough on this one. Yellow eyes are really cool. The teeth are really nice. Wish they were a little bit more jagged though, personally. Uh, but either way, overall, it's a pretty cool looking pop. And that, that's really sick, to be honest. Check that out, guys. That thing is insane. The detail on it alone is just crazy. That's awesome. I love it. That's so freaking cool. Definitely a really cool Yu-Gi-Oh pop. I'm glad they made it a six inch pop. That's sick. Okay. Uh, let's throw the box down here. Um, hmm. Well, this is out, so why don't we just open this up, huh? Uh, so Notorious Custom actually did send this over, and he's been wanting to do a giveaway for a while. I think, I think originally, oh my gosh, he must ask me if he, we want, if I wanted to do a giveaway with him for like months ago. I want to say like over half a year ago, something like that. Maybe a year ago, if even. And we finally, he finally sent one out. <laughs> He's just a busy dude. Um, and he finally sent one out and he chose the bloody Tanjiro here. Well, I guess I kind of chose it for you guys as well because he asked me about two and I was like, well, I think they'll like this one. So we ended up doing the, the Tanjiro here. 
And uh, I think you guys would really enjoy this. So it's like a bloody metallic version here. And he does a lot of different ones, so you guys can check him out on Instagram. All right, guys, so there is his little sticker there if you guys want to check him out on IG. Super nice dude. Wow, this thing is amazing. Even the hair is metallic. That's so freaking cool. So again, guys, make sure to let me know down below by leaving a like on this video if you guys do want to see this given away fairly soon here. More likes, I guess, the faster we can get this giveaway out to you, so stay tuned. Also, another giveaway, I'm actually giving away one of these uh, t-shirts on, uh, on my Instagram right now. A lot of you guys are always asking me where I get my t-shirts from, so if you want to know, head over to the Instagram, into the giveaway, and then you can, you know, check out that page too. All right, so let me put this back in its insert because I don't want to mess it up. Well, if I can get it back in there. There we go. I don't want to mess it up, so I'm going to put it back in the box here. Uh, but I'm super excited to give that away for you guys because that thing is amazing. All right, um, so now we do have, do I want to open this? Oh, do I, because I, I kind of want to check out the glow. The thing is, I'm worried that the t-shirt, I, I kind of want, I don't know. I kind of want to keep it sealed. I don't keep most of my tea bundles sealed. I don't have any tea bundles sealed. I have an extra no skate. Do I have any tea bundles up there? No, what was the last tea bundle? It was a no skate and then also the anti venom. But those are the only other tea bundles I have. Maybe I'll keep Hobgoblin here sealed. He's a pretty cool... Nah, let's open it. I want to see the pop. <laughs> uh, let's see it. Let's open it. I want to see this beautiful pop here. Oh, please tell me the t-shirt's comfortable. Because I really like this one. If the t-shirt's not comfortable, I usually just sell it. Because I don't... I, I just don't wear the uncomfortable ones. Is it a soft... Oh! Oh yeah, it's the soft stuff. That's great, I'm so excited about that. Here, let me show you guys. Yep, it's one of the comfortable ones. This is actually a large too, because these Funko Tees do shrink. This is probably gonna be a little bit big on me for a while, but um, when it does shrink, I'll definitely wear it. So I'll probably wash it at least once to see. Your mind, Spidey. That's amazing, Hobgoblin. That's so awesome. I love that they made a new Hobgoblin pop, because, I mean, he was long overdue for another, you know, mold and things like that. Um, but, you know, the original one is still maintaining its value, which I think is a really, really awesome as well. Hobgoblin here. Oh, he has a little damage there. No worries. This is really sweet, though. Hobgoblin. Oh, man, and this is the glow-in-the-dark one. I have not been able to find this one in stores at all. I almost took, or jumped the gun and ordered one. Oh, it has this big crease in the back there. Um... But I almost jumped the gun and actually ordered it in uh, on Mercari a couple times. But I was like, no, let me hold out. Maybe I'll find it in stores. And yeah, <laughs> Captain Pops was able to help me out. Appreciate it, dude. Thank you so much. Um, this is awesome. $24.99. Not a bad price for a pop and tea, too. This is so sweet. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to actually give you guys a, um, like a glow pick because it's literally like... 10:30 in the morning, so I doubt it. But so I'll throw up a picture for you guys of what it actually does look like. But it has a sick glow, and I'm definitely gonna check it out later when it gets dark. Either way, that's super. Well, I guess actually, wait. I haven't taken out the pop. I can at least take out the pop for you guys. <laughs> I can at least do that and show you guys the pop. He does have a tr little translucent look to him since he is uh, he is glow, and I see the glow paint all over. Oh man, that's sick. Look at the glider. Oh wait, my glider's messed up. Is it supposed to be like that? Oh, it's not! What happened? If you guys see closely there, you can see like it's missing a chunk out of his face, like he's in a battle damage. That is horrible. How does that even happen? That's crazy. It's overall, it's a beautiful looking pop, but dang, that ruins its out of out of box like display. I'll definitely maybe have to pick up another one. That's crazy. Again, I'll give you guys one more look. It's a sick pop though. Absolutely love it. Can't wait to add it to the Spidey collection. All right guys, so it is moment of truth time. Our Galactic Toys package here. Again, did forget that I did order this one. I've actually already unboxed this on the channel if you guys want to see like a full review and everything like that. Um, I unboxed this one like, oh, probably like five months ago now. So, no, maybe like three months ago. Four months ago, something like that. I boxed this a while ago. I got them in early from Hong Kong uh, to review for you guys. And yeah, you guys absolutely love those videos. And thank you so much for all the support on those. But yeah, guys, we reviewed this a while back. So I already seen the glow and everything like that. It is a really awesome pop. We could definitely take it out of box one more if you guys want to see. But whew, moment of truth. Did I get a chase? Did I not? A lot of people were getting chases from single orders too. So it's very possible. Uh, oh, <laughs> Look at that, guys. I'm not saying we got the chase. 
we open it from the bottom. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm like, oh, we still got a chance. I'm so, why am I nervous? Like, it's funny. I actually don't have this one in the collection anymore. Um, okay. Okay. Three, two, one. Ah, oh, no chase. No chase. No chase. I do have a big soda video coming up. I have a bunch of Bakugo uh, sodas that I did buy, so we're going to be doing like a Chase Roulette style video for that, like an anime one, but we didn't get a chase, but we do have the regular uh, Tundra, though, where, which is still not a bad pool. I don't, again, I don't have this one with this sticker in the collection, so I'm definitely going to throw that back there. Super awesome. Um, <laughs> it's really awesome. I still love the Water Dragon one more. It has a phenomenal glow, but this one's a really cool one, too. Um, either way, though, guys, this is awesome. Sweet, glad it finally came in. Almost a year, jeez Louise. Funko Pop pre-orders are just crazy. I don't know. Some things, some things scare me to pre-order these days because situations like these. It's Demon Slayer, it's still coming in. Like literally, some people haven't even gotten their orders yet of this. So absolutely nuts. But for the most part, guys, yeah, pretty solid video. I had a lot of fun with this. We uh, we didn't score the chase, but that's okay. I got my pre-order and I'm happy with that. And uh, does look to be in good shape as well. We'll take it out of the protector and double check. These are kind of flimsy, the protectors. <laughs> um, anyways, at least it came in a protector though, that was awesome. Uh, let's see. Um, no, looks good. Pretty good. We got bubble wrap too, so awesome. All right, then we also did have the Stardust Dragon, which was so freaking cool. Oh, he does have a base stand too. Cause he, he was he was falling over a couple times when I was in between uh, takes, so it was very interesting there. Hobgoblin, Glimmerdark, can't wait to check that out. And of course, the Tanjiro. We have the double, double Tanjiro's here. Again, if you guys want to see a giveaway on this one soon, make sure to smash that like button. But anyways, guys, I had a lot of fun. I've been wanting to open some packages soon here because I literally have like 25 boxes piled up. It's absolutely insane. And it's all kinds of random stuff. So if you guys want to see another unboxing video in the future or one mega unboxing, let me know down below, guys. Let me know, did you guys pull a chase from the Tanjiro uh, Galactic Toys? Did you do a little bit of a chase roulette? Or did you actually order the bundle and get the guaranteed chase? I'd love to know. Um, as well, guys, is what's a pickup recently that you did also pick up? Um, again, we have some really, really cool stuff coming, especially for the channel. Like, oh, I wish I could tell you this one thing that I'm going to be doing in March. It's going to be so much fun, and I can't wait to actually tease it for you guys when I'm allowed to. As well, guys, as we do have another charity auction coming up. Like, I'm just trying to give you guys an, an update on everything going on. I have so many plans. It's so awesome. Um, definitely more auctions in the future. I want to be more on whatnot. Um, working on a collaboration and, uh, you know, partnership with them, which is going to be cool. Um... I'm trying to think what else. Collecticon is coming up this weekend, so that's going to be a lot of fun. Another Comic-Con video, so can't wait for that. Uh, and other than that, guys, yeah, just a few updates and uh, just letting you guys know what videos we're going to see and things like that. I got a couple video ideas brewing as well. Um, some really nice things, trying to mix it up and come up with new video ideas. So, And also, if you guys ever have a video suggestion of something you want to see on the channel here, comment it down below because I can definitely make that happen. Either way, I'll stop rambling. Thank you guys so much for watching. I do appreciate and love you guys for it. Thank you guys seriously for all the support. We're almost at 50K, and that's going to be amazing. I do want to say a big shout out to all the Patreon supporters of the channel. Thank you guys so much for being rock stars of the channel. I really do appreciate and love you guys for it. If you guys want to check out the Patreon, the link is down below. We do have a Patreon only Discord where we do share a lot of the news that is shared on the channel first. So if you want first access, make sure to check out that Patreon link down below. We also do have a Facebook group with over 11,000 members, which is super awesome. And we'd love to have you. It's a buy, sell, and trade group as well, guys. Is make sure to follow all of my social medias, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, all at Skittle Rampage to stay up to date. All right, love you guys. See you guys later. Bye.